Lights, Camera, Jamuru, Adventures of a Filmmaker in Ethiopia, by Bob Mad Dams is a captivating literary work that offers readers a unique glimpse into the world of filmmaking in the Ethiopian landscape. Through his personal experiences and vivid storytelling, Mad Dams weaves together a narrative that not only explores the challenges of filmmaking in a foreign country but also delves into the cultural and social intricacies of Ethiopia. One of the central themes in Madam's narrative is the collision of cultures. As a foreign filmmaker venturing into Ethiopia, Mad Dams faces the inevitable clash between his Western background and the Ethiopian way of life. This clash is most evident in his interactions with the locals, who view the filmmaking process with a mixture of curiosity and skepticism. Mad Dam skillfully portrays the intricate dance of miscommunication, cultural misunderstandings, and the gradual bridge building that occurs as he works closely with the Ethiopian crew. This theme highlights the universal challenge of navigating unfamiliar territory and the power of human connection to transcend cultural barriers. Moreover, Madam's narrative underscores the power of storytelling as a means of preservation. Through the lens of his camera, Mad Dams captures not only the beauty of Ethiopia's landscapes but also the stories of its people. He chronicles the lives of individuals living in remote villages, shedding light on their struggles, dreams, and aspirations. In doing so, he becomes a custodian of their narratives, ensuring that their voices are heard beyond the confines of their immediate communities. This theme of storytelling as a form of cultural preservation resonates deeply, emphasizing the importance of acknowledging and preserving the diversity of human experiences. Another prominent element of Madam's narrative is his exploration of the filmmaking process itself. He takes readers on a journey behind the scenes, revealing the challenges and triumphs of bringing a creative vision to life. Madam's passion for filmmaking is palpable as he describes the exhilaration of capturing the perfect shot and the frustration of dealing with unforeseen obstacles. This aspect of the narrative offers valuable insights into the artistry and dedication required to produce a compelling film. Additionally, Madam's writing skillfully addresses the broader issue of the global film industry's impact on local cultures. As he navigates the complexities of securing funding and distribution for his film, he sheds light on the economic and ethical dilemmas faced by filmmakers who straddle the line between art and commerce. This theme prompts readers to reflect on the role of media in shaping perceptions and the potential consequences of Western media influence on non-Western cultures. Madam's writing style is characterized by vivid descriptions that transport readers to the Ethiopian landscape. His evocative prose captures the colors, sounds, and scents of the country, allowing readers to immerse themselves fully in the narrative. This sensory richness enhances the storytelling experience and reinforces the idea that Ethiopia is not just a backdrop but a character in its own right. In conclusion, Lights, Camera, Jamuru, Adventures of a Filmmaker in Ethiopia, by Bob Mad Dams is a compelling literary work that explores themes of cultural collision, storytelling, the filmmaking process, and the impact of the global film industry on local cultures. Madam's ability to intertwine these themes with personal anecdotes and vibrant descriptions of Ethiopia creates a narrative that is both informative and emotionally resonant. Through his journey, readers gain a deeper appreciation for the complexities of cross-cultural interactions and the transformative power of storytelling. Madam's book is a testament to the enduring allure of the written word and its capacity to transport readers to far-off lands while shedding light on universal human experiences.